How to install mods in Minecraft Hello everyone, I am Bishaka and welcome to our channel. I will take you through the step-by-step -step process on how to install mods in Minecraft. Now, let's get right into the tutorial. Mods are user-made modifications to an original game. Usually, Minecraft mods include new items, blocks, resource packs, interface changes and overall quality of life improvements for players. Before we go any further, make sure you have set up a Minecraft server and installed the Java Development Kit, also known as JDK. However, there are some factors to consider before installing Minecraft Forge or adding mods in general. First, most Minecraft servers run on the Java edition of the game. Unfortunately, the Bedrock edition does not support mods and only works with add-ons from the official Mojang Studios Minecraft Marketplace. Second, each mod will significantly increase server RAM uses so, make sure that your hardware is able to handle it. Third, back up your server files before installing any mods to have a clean restoration point in case something goes wrong. And, you will need to stop the server to install any new mods. The installation process might still be successful if the server is running, but any changes will only appear after restarting it. Now that your Minecraft server is running and the JDK has been set up, we can proceed with the Minecraft mod installation process. The most popular modding add-on today is Minecraft Forge. It allows players to install and manage custom mods on the Java edition of Minecraft. Check the following steps to install Minecraft Forge on Windows Minecraft server. First. Go to the official Minecraft Forge website and download the recommended version. Second, a new window will pop up. After a short countdown, click the skip button. Once downloaded, open the Minecraft Forge installer, select install client and press OK. The client version will allow players to join the Minecraft Forge server if an error message about a missing Minecraft profile pops up, ensure that the default Minecraft launcher is installed. Third, rerun the installer once more, but this time select the installer server option. Specify the directory used by the vanilla Minecraft server. Ignore the warning message. There is no need to worry about that. Now proceed with the installation process and open the newly created folder and double click the run.bat file. Then your Minecraft server will start alongside Minecraft Forge. The next step finally involves downloading actual Minecraft mods. We recommend browsing through such popular sites as Curse Forge or Minecraft mods. Open the website and check the Minecraft version indicated on the mod page. Your game must match it. If it checks out, hit the download button. So this is how you can install mods in Minecraft. If you find this tutorial helpful, smash that like button, comment if you have any queries and be sure to subscribe to our channel, Login Giants for similar helpful tutorials. See you on the next one.